Okay, here's an example on subprogramming. We're in CNC base. The first line we have is uh, absolute programming. Then we're going to inch measurement. We're doing this the same way we normally do. Uh, we pick a tool, tool number two, which happens to be a quarter inch end mill cutter. Under line four, we are turning our spindle on in a clockwise direction, 800 RPMs. Line five, we position ourselves uh, one inch in the X, one inch in the Y, and 100,000 above the surface. The next thing we do is on line six is we feed down to the surface of zero. Uh, we have to give it a feed rate, uh, 20 inches per minute. Then on line seven, we call up our sub program. M98 calls up a sub. P100 happens to be the program number. L11 is the loops. It goes around 11 times. And here's the information for that. L stands for loops. And we're going to be doing it 11 times. All right. Then we're going to go from line 7 to down here to where the subprogram starts. Notice the P100 here. So whenever it reaches this, it's going to skip all of this little information here and go down to where the subprogram starts. Now, in order to do a subprogram, we have to do this in incremental, which is a G91, which is point to point. So the next line under line 18 here, G01, Z is going down into the work, uh, into this part, 50 thousandths deep. Uh, under line 19, we're traveling in our Y axis, not from home, but from our last movement, which was already one inch in the X and one inch in the Y. We're traveling only in our Y axis only. That's going to be a positive direction. Line 20. We're traveling in our x-axis, and that's also a positive direction. However, line 21, we're going to be descending uh, two inches in a negative direction. And the same with line 22. Uh, we're going to be going in a negative direction in our x-axis. Line 23 tells us we've already gone around this part 11 times. And once we've gone around the 11th time, it jumps to the last line, which is the line 23 takes us back to our absolute programming, and it cancels, uh, it goes back to the main program, which cancels your sub. Once it does that, we come back up here to where the line under the M98, we feed back to the surface of zero. Then under line 11, we're going to wrap it three inches above the surface. Line 12 takes X and Y home, and line 13 ends your program. 